Got an 8260R today we're working on. Customer said that the SCVs and the hitch are throwing codes and none of the functions are working for the three point and the SCVs. So let's see what we got going on. So we got a service advisor hooked up to the tractor here. And we've got a bunch of active codes for number one, two, three, and four SCV that are missing as well as the hitch control valve are missing as well. So let's see what we can figure out what's causing a couple of these controllers to go offline while most of the rest of the tractor still is working. So I'm back here on the SCV stack and you've got four SCVs here and one hitch controller. And they're all running through the same harness here. So I started out by unplugging them all and I hooked my multimeter into the extra plugs here. I started checking my can voltages. And this is the can bus side, the low side. And I just started plugging each one in at one at a time and watching my voltages. And as soon as I plugged in the hitch controller, as you can see, my voltage drops to about zero. So with the hitch valve unplugged, and I can run the tractor and all the SCVs will go to working. So as long as I keep this hitch controller unplugged, all the SCVs will continue to work. And he had a sprayer on here and he had it unfolded. And once I unplugged the hitch controller and cycle key power, then the SCV started working and I was able to fold up the sprayer here. So we know we got something going on with that hitch valve. Something inside the hitch controller is causing the CAN bus voltage to get shorted out to ground. And so we're going to have to install a new hitch valve controller to fix the issue. I can take 